Hi everyone, Dr. Sean Flynn here. Hope everyone's doing okay. Well, today's topic comes from a question from, from one of the viewers is whether or not getting a dental implant is painful. So the actual thought of getting an implant can give people a sense that it will be very painful, but that's not necessarily true. But most people think that cutting to the jaw and placing an implant, making a hole into the jaw can cause a lot of pain, okay? Well, this is because most of the time patients will look on the internet and YouTube videos um, for implant placement videos. And all you see are drills, big instruments, blood everywhere. And so when you look at all that, it's not, the, uh, it makes most patients feel like it's just a very extreme, painful procedure. But in fact, it's not a difficult procedure um, or as painful as it looks. So in terms of the scale of pain, now, let's see. If the procedure is straightforward, a patient has healthy bones, they're young, um, there's not a lot of soft tissue manipulation, then that means there's gonna be very little pain for a couple days and maybe just need some ibuprofen. Now, if the procedure requires a bone graft, extraction, a lot of soft tissue manipulation, um, then the pain is gonna uh, probably be a little bit stronger and so probably need a more stronger pain reliever. But it's still not, extremely painful to the extent that people really think so. Now, the actual pain that the patient actually feel is actually not from the implant creating the hole. Um, it's actually from the amount of soft tissue lifting there needs to be. Um, so if we have to lift a lot of soft tissue, the patient can have a little more pain after the procedure. If it's a little less soft tissue, they would barely feel anything, maybe some soreness. So that's pretty much it. The bottom line is that dental implant surgery can be painful depending on the health of the gums and the bone, um, and also how much soft tissue manipulation there has to be. So in order to find that out, talk to your dentist or oral surgeon um, who will be doing the procedure, and they will let you know. Alrighty guys, if you guys have any more questions, please let us know. Thank you.